hey you guys welcome back to my channel i know you like we already saw this look sis but i decided to do another video with giving you my top five only five favorite fragrances because i mean it's summertime it's getting hot outside you know you want to smell good you want to look good you want to you know just mm, when you smell good you just feel good you just it just come all together and on top of that you want to make sure when you give a walk away smell you know that's you know that smell when you smell when somebody walk past you that they be like mm, what she got on because i love when people do that to me so i'm gonna give you my top five and maybe you all will go out and try it all right let's just go ahead and get right into the video my first fragrance is the soul de janeiro janeiro i don't know but this is the brazilian crush body fragrance mist this ranges from 19 dollars to 32 dollars i purchased mine off of their actual website but you can get it from sephora the 3.04 ounce is 19 dollars the 8.1 ounce is 32 dollars now i'm not sure if you all have actually smelt their brazilian bum bum cream but it smells so good and that's what made me get this fragrance mist because i received that as a sample from sephora i received the bum bum cream and i said oh it smells so good but i'm not really a fan of uh, like body butters or creams and things like that because i have sensitive skin so when i found out that they came out with a fragrance i was like oh yes and it smells just like the bum bum cream it smells so good so i definitely recommend this one this is for normal oily combination dry and sensitive skin so pretty much all skin types you know it's good for as far as the brazilian body fragrance i usually use this in the daytime to me this is more of a daytime fragrance i know that sounds weird like what is daytime what is nighttime it's just it just to me it's just a fragrance that you need to use for certain occasions and this one i specifically put on during the day i do not use this at night at all yes i love this one and i believe this is the cheapest out of all of the uh fragrances that i have so this one i definitely give a thumbs up my next fragrance is the viva la juicy this comes in a roller ball which is 0.33 ounce it also comes in a 1.7 ounce and it also comes in a 3.4 ounce i have the 3.4 ounce bottle which is 99 dollars on sephora website but let me let y'all in on a little secret secret all right i got mine from groupon and guess how much you got 37.99 so don't say i didn't tell you <laughs> don't be spending them coins if you can save something okay so this is a floral fragrance it has warm florals as far as the scent type and the key notes are wild berries jasmine and vanilla this one i can use in the daytime and in the nighttime it is it can go for both occasions with this one and i really really love this one i have been using this one for a very long time i did have this before ran out of it so that's how and, and the 3.4 ounce that's a big bottle so i ran out of it so i got another one this is one that's definitely a must to get the next fragrance i have is the victoria's secret bombshell perfume i have the 1.7 ounce they do have the option for a 3.4 ounce which is 68 dollars the 1.7 ounce is 55 but i got mine during their semi-annual sale so it was 50 percent off so once again i'm putting you in on on something so if you want to wait until they got names in, go ahead and do that but i love this fragrance i have put this on to multiple people and they all love it so i definitely recommend this one as well this is a fruity floral fragrance type and their key notes are purple passion fruit shangri la peony and vanilla orchid and i believe this is one of their signature perfumes because they carry different variations of it the one that i have is a 2017 edition so i didn't even see it on their website anymore but honestly 
I don't see much of a difference in their different bombshells that they have because I'm going to show you all. I also have the bombshells in bloom and I can tell a slight difference, but it's nothing majorly different. So I believe they just change it up just a little bit, but they all reference each other. So if you're looking for something to get when they have their semi-annual sale or if you just balling like that and you don't care, go ahead and get this one. So is that Victoria's Secret and you can get it online on their website. Next up is Gucci. Gucci, Gucci, Gucci. I got this from Sephora. This is the Gucci Flora Gorgeous Gardenia perfume for her and this was $78 now let me tell y'all I am the queen of trying to get a deal somewhere so when I kicked off $78 sis was hurt okay I was hurt I was thinking about that all day like did I really just pay $78 for this perfume but when I tell you when I smelled it in store I had to get it I don't know if you all can relate but sometimes when I spray something on it has a strong smell to it, like an alcohol smell. So I have to let it sit for a little bit before I can determine whether or not I really want this perfume. When I sprayed this perfume the first time, I immediately said, I have to get this. And this was the last one that they had in store in my area. And it was sold out online. So it does show that it is in stock now. But when I got this, I said, oh, yes, I have to get it. And, you know, when you see it's the last one, that makes you want to get it even more because you want to feel like you're exclusive and stuff. But, yeah. So, this is in the Floral Fragrance family. It has fruity florals. And their keynotes are red berries, white gardenia, and patchouli. Now, this fragrance I would specifically wear at nighttime. This is a nighttime fragrance, like date night trying to get some action sis come here because you smell good that's what the type of fragrance this is for me like this is definitely that and i always wear this when i go on a date because i want him to be smelling me like babe you smell so good and guess what he definitely be doing that <laughs> so I, I this is definitely one of the more expensive fragrances but I definitely, definitely, definitely recommend this. If you want to just splurge just a little bit, you know, you deserve it. You do a lot. So go ahead and splurge. It is nothing wrong with it. Now, my next fragrance is the Victor and Rolf. Rolf? Rolf? I don't know. R-O-L-F, the Flower Bomb. I do have the Travel Duo because I actually bought this when I was out of town. So I caught a flight to where I was at and, you know, how TSA is you can't bring certain things the certain it got to be certain ounces blah 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 I just <laughs> I just didn't even you know get the big bottle I just got the small travel size which was $35 now the travel size one it comes with a 0.25 ounce perfume and it comes with a 0.5 ounce refill so it's like a well, pretty much that's self-explanatory. I don't have to explain that to y'all. So yeah, it comes with a 0.25 ounce perfume and a refill. And it comes with a funnel. So you can fill the bottle back up if you run out. And the notes in this one is Samback Jasmine, Centifolia Rose, Catalia Orchid, Ballerina Frisia, and Patchouli. And this one is definitely a nighttime fragrance as well that I will only wear in the nighttime this one and the Gucci is hand in hand because the flower bomb I have heard people talking about this a lot and when I saw the price of it I just was like I can't I, I just can't like because it's not cheap at all this one comes in different sizes so it has the 0 0.25 uh, 0 0.68 0.33 you know it comes in different ones the biggest size is a three, well, I'm sorry, no. The biggest size is a five ounce, and that is $215. Who gonna pay that? Not me. But if you definitely like this, it comes in different sizes. So yeah, I would recommend this one as well. So these are my top five fragrances of all time, okay? I love perfume. 
I have others as well, but these are my top five that I definitely recommend to everybody. I have never met not one person that I put these perfumes onto and they didn't like it. So if you're like me and you love perfume and you're looking for something to make you smell, you know, good, go ahead and get these. Thank you for watching this video, you all. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like this video. And if you buy one of these perfumes and like it, let me know, all right? So I'll see you all next time. Bye.